Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm gonna to be sharing my April favorites. And these are gonna be more like stay at home favorites because this is literally the only thing I've been using since we have been forced to stay at home. So the very first thing I have to mention before I mention anything else in this video is my Nespresso machine. OMG. If you follow my vlogs, if you follow my Instagram, you know that I am obsessed with my Nespresso machine. I will insert a clip here for you guys because it's too big for me to bring in here to show you. Um, but yeah, I'll show you a picture now. So yeah, guys, I have literally used my machine every single day, several times a day, this entire month. Yes, like that's how obsessed I am with it. Like it makes me so, so, so happy. Literally, first thing when I wake up, it's like the most exciting part of my day besides seeing my son, obviously. But it is just so exciting to just use it and just smell it and look at it. It's so pretty. And I just, I love it, love it, love it so much. And today my mom surprised me and got me a new frother. Um, I had mentioned in one of my vlogs that I wanted a white frother to match my machine. And my mom watches my videos and she got it for me. So thank you so much, mom. Um, so yes, that has completed my like Nespresso obs obsession. Also, speaking of which, I am actually having uh, espresso right now, but I did get some Nespresso mugs as well off the site. Uh, I had mentioned in my last video that I did when I kind of talked about my machine that I was open to getting some Nespresso mugs. So I went ahead and got a set. They came... Um, in, in a set of two and then they also came with uh, a set of spoons so i thought that was really nice so i'll definitely link that for you guys um in case you want to check it out i know a lot of you have purchased an espresso so thank you all so much for like jumping on this nespresso bandwagon with me i mean what better thing to have or what better thing to kind of splurge on than a really nice coffee machine when you're literally forced to stay inside all day like I mean it's perfect I'll link the exact one that I have in the description for you guys but yes now let's get into the video so first things I want to mention are just some skincare items this youth to the people facial cleanser hands down my absolute favorite 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 facial cleanser i love it so much it is literally like halfway through because i use it day and night i will link my skincare routine video for you guys i have a day and night skincare routine so i'll link that um, if you're interested in watching but i just love this it's so good it's so worth it if you want if you want a daily facial cleanser that doesn't have all the harsh chemicals and things like that in it so definitely recommend this one it is amazing i love it Next thing I want to share is the Youth to the People facial cream. Now, this I bought when I got this, and I had never tried this before, so this was my first time trying it, and I've literally like been using it so much, so much so that one of my friends on Instagram saw one of my videos, I think, and she recommended this a Sweet Chef Superfood Vitamins Moisture Boost um, cream that you can get at Target. Oh my goodness, first of all, it's like half the price of this one. It's in a nice glass jar like this one. The reason I kept the box is because this is how it's displayed in the store. It's not displayed like this, so I wanted you guys to know what to look for. I'll put a link for you all too. But this is the perfect dupe for this one, in my opinion. And to be honest, I actually like this one better. It's so much more moisturizing. It literally smells the same. They actually kind of look the same. So this one is, yes, uh, Superfood and Vitamins Moisture Boost 
hydrates, soothes, and brightens. So that's this one. And then this one is a superfood air whip moisture cream. So they're both kind of like the same consistency and texture, but for some reason, this one is just so much more moisturizing in my opinion. So if you're looking for something that is more cost efficient, I would definitely go with this one over this one because they're essentially the same but this is like $18 and this is like $40 and yeah so highly recommend this one also recommend this one too I mean I was literally going through this like water before I was introduced to this so they also have some serums as well now I almost bought a serum when I bought this but I was like mm, let me try out this moisturizer first but I'm definitely going back to get the serum because this stuff is so good so definitely check this out if you're looking for a good moisturizer that's like in that superfoods natural you know line so definitely recommend that I've also been loving this Ole Hendrix eye cream. I use this every night under my eyes. It is amazing. I absolutely love it. Came highly recommend by a lot of my friends out there who are like beauty enthusiasts and like skincare enthusiasts. So yes, I highly recommend this. It is really good. I really enjoyed using this. I've also enjoyed using the Ole Hendrix um, vitamin C the Truth Serum, this I've also been using every night and I need to slow down, which is why I wanna go back and get that serum in this one because I'm literally going through this and yeah, I can already tell it's gonna be gone before the summer is over. Um, but love it, makes my skin feel so good. I usually wear it at night and I love waking up in the morning and my skin still has like that dewy, glowy look. Like that is the best feeling ever when you wake up and you go in the bathroom and you look like so vibrant and refreshed after a good night's rest. So I definitely will recommend this as well to you guys. I've also been loving this Neutrogena Hydro Boost Water Gel. This is a very cost efficient, um, moisturizer as well now it is pricey for a drugstore brand but it's really good but it is oil free so if you're looking for something that is like super moisturizing this isn't it but this is really good for like hydrating like my skin always feels so good and hydrated when i use this so i usually will wear this when i'm wearing my neutrogena um, facial spf um, so those two together work really well. So I highly recommend this. It's really good. And again, I will put a link for this because you can find this in the drugstore. Next up is this Thayer's Rose Water Spray. Oh my goodness. This stuff is so good. I mentioned this in a vlog a while back when I was sharing just some things that I've been enjoying using. At that time, I had just started using this. And so I was like sold after a week of using it. But now after a month, this stuff is so good. I will probably not buy any other facial sprays. No, I take that back. I'll probably buy more facial sprays. But this is really good for a drugstore facial mist. Um, I compare this to the Mario Badesco uh, facial spray. It's very, very, very close to that. I, I actually own that one, and I find myself using this a lot more. Um, I feel like you get a lot more in this for your money. Price-wise, I think they're about the same in price, but I feel like you get more um, with the Thayer's. So I've been enjoying using this. I use it every morning and every night as a toner. Um, you can also use it throughout the day just to freshen up your face if you want to. So this has been great. So on to some makeup items. I literally have not been wearing like much makeup at all, but that's no different than any other day for me. I don't typically do a full face of makeup anyway, but the items that I have been enjoying using just every morning, just a quick little, you know, face to put on if, if you know, that's what you wanna call it. So my Chanel mascara, can't say enough good things about it. I've tried other mascaras and they just don't compare. So I will always, always, always will continue to buy this. It is pricey, but it's so worth it. I love it. And yes, best mascara ever. 
my NARS Creamy Concealer in the shade Caramel. Love it. Never experienced any creasing. Um, someone asked me that. No, I, I've been wearing this since forever. This is the only concealer I've actually ever worn. I've never worn any other concealers. So I really don't have it have anything to compare it to, but I love this. It comes highly recommended. You can check the reviews, but it's it's amazing. I absolutely love all NARS products. Like any makeup item that I have, it's from NARS. So I'm like a true NARS girl, but this concealer, hands down the best. And I literally just put this on in the morning. Like no tint of moisturizer, no blush, no powder, none of that. These are the two things that I reach for every morning and that's it. And then as far as lippies, the NARS lip balm and lip oil have been my go-to. Literally the only thing that I put on my lips. So you guys ask me in my videos, what's on your lips? This, it's either this balm, this is in the shade Orgasm. So I'm either wearing this or I'm either wearing this lip oil. This lip oil is so good. I need to order another one, but I absolutely love it. Um, it's the best and this little combo together is amazing so i'm either wearing this by itself or these two together so yes again nars never fails me they have some of the best products out there i am a creature of habit i like what i like and if i find something that i love i will continue to buy it over and over and over again no matter how much it costs few body care items that i want to share with you guys so the first one is this Diptyque body spray that I discovered uh, while we've been quarantined. Absolutely love this. I've never had any Diptyque fragrances ever um, and I'm sold. This is in the Dosan and it's just a really nice body mist. It's not a perfume. It's not a splash. It's very just nice. It gives you a luxurious scent without the luxurious price that's the best way i can describe it i mean for the price point and the amount of product that you get it's pretty amazing like i will continue to buy this over and over again it looks nice it's very sleek and chic looking which i love it smells amazing now it does not have lasting power so that's the one downside to this but i'm okay with that because I'm home all day, so I literally just spray it throughout the day. Whenever I feel like I can't smell it on myself, I just spray it again. And I've had this for over a month, and this is about as much as I've, as I've used. And I use it every day, several times a day. I definitely use it every morning when I get out the shower. I spray it all over my body. And sometimes in the evening when I take a shower, I'll spray it on too just to smell good before I go to bed. But... This stuff is so good. I love it. It's the best luxury fragrance that I found that is cost efficient because I just don't feel right using my more expensive fragrances while I'm sitting in the house. Like that just does not make sense to me. As much as I love them all, I, I would rather save them for when outside opens back up and just use this. Um, so... It doesn't have to be a diptyque body mist. I just chose this one because I wanted something that still gave me like a luxurious like scent. But you can definitely just find a nice body splash or a body mist out there. Um, I know, what is that, Pink Sugar has a really nice one if you like more of a sweet scent. But this one, I love it. Can't say enough good things about it. Next up is this Brazilian Bum Bum Cream. So I actually got this in like my birthday set from Sephora a while ago, and it came in a set of two. This one was my favorite. The other one was okay. I wouldn't recommend it. I think it's like a coconut one. I'm not a big fan of coconut scent things or coconut at all, but this one, oh, oh, it's so good. Like I see why people rave about this i definitely would recommend this it smells so good and i can't wait to get my bigger size because it's that good i also think they have like a body splash as well um i haven't tried that but i bet it's good because if it smells as good as this 
it's got to be good. So definitely recommend the Bum Bum Cream in the orange packaging, not the blue. I mean, if you like coconut stuff, then you may like it, but this one was my favorite out of the two. And so just like the rest of us, I have not been able to get a pedicure in over a month. So the struggle is real for me, but I have been doing my best to keep my feet feeling smooth and looking good. And one of the products that I have been using to help with that is this Soap and Glory Heel Genius. Now, I have been a Soap and Glory fan for several years from back, back, back in the day. And I rediscovered this during quarantine. I'm like, look, I scrub my feet, I use my buffers, you know, I make sure that they, you know, I keep them manicured, but I need something that to just give them that soft, like fresh out the pedicure chair feeling. This is it. So if you do this in combination with like, if you do at home pedicures yourself, like if you soak your feet yourself, this is perfect. So basically what I do is right before I go to bed, I literally keep this on my bedside uh, table. And right before I go to bed, I just put it on my feet. And I'm telling you, you will see such a huge difference in like your heels. I, I put it all over. It says heel genius, but I just put it all over my feet and it feels so good. So check this out. Another product that you can get in the drugstores now. Um, I remember when I first started using Soap and Glory, you can only get it like on, at Sephora or Ulta, but now you can get it at any drugstore. So I'll put a link for you guys. But until we can get back in the nail salons and get nice fancy pedicures this this is what you need now on to hair products I am NOT a fan of doing my own hair it is the one thing that I absolutely cannot stand doing <laughs> and I dread it every time this quarantine has forced me to have to do my own hair and I am just not feeling that. But I will say, in between me doing my own hair, this Living Proof Dry Shampoo has definitely saved me. It's so good. I literally talk about this stuff all the time. I've shared it with all of my friends. I've shared it with family members. Anyone out there that is struggling right now and can't get to the hair salon and they're doing their own hair, but they're not washing their hair every day because obviously black girls don't wash their hair every day. So if you're someone like me and you work out a lot and you sweat in your hair a lot, but you don't want to wash your hair like two, three times a week, Definitely check out this dry shampoo. I've tried other dry shampoos. They do not compare to this one. Again, another product that you can get in drugstores um, as well as other department stores too. So I love that about this brand. I love this about a lot of these brands because, you know, a lot of stores aren't open and, you know, sometimes you need something right away real quick. So if you live somewhere where you can do like a curbside pickup at a drugstore, you can get this. So definitely recommend a dry shampoo because it is essential while we're staying at home, stuck in the house, and we're still working out and sweating and you know, all that jazz. All right, and I almost forgot, polish, oh my goodness. So yeah, a another thing <laughs> about me, I, don't paint my own nails like I'm horrible at it so this glitter polish by OPI glitter to my heart is the best like I literally have no struggle with painting my nails with this it's it's a clear sparkle so it's not like massive glitter you probably can't even see it's very subtle and it has a lot of like little white flakes in it so it almost comes off as like a white like clear manicure so if you are someone like me and you struggle with painting your own nails definitely check this one out i can't speak for any other glitter polishes i know um one of my subscribers had recommended a dupe for this by essie that she found i don't know how well that works but if i can find this one because it was sold out for a long time but if i can find this one for you guys i will definitely put a link 
for you it's from the hello kitty collection but this has saved my nails like and because it's so sparkly it makes me happy so that helps um but yeah again if you're someone like me and you struggle with painting your nails this is the polish for you um it Honestly, like, and I'm not a big glitter person, but this is really good. I like it, and it's been saving me. So, yeah. Obviously, there is a virus going on right now, so everybody is taking precaution. Um, yeah, everybody's doing whatever they can to stay healthy. For me, in my house, we have been using probiotics. This is by the brand Oli. Love it. It's a mango flavor but i love it i give it to me and my son every single day neither one of us have been sick knock on wood but he's been healthy i've been healthy we we've been good i've also been doing vitamin c every single day um i get this one from whole foods it's like the largest one that they have just because me and my son take them every single morning so i want to make sure that we continue to get vitamin C by any means. So this combination has definitely been helping us during this quarantine time. I know that there are other supplements and things that you can get, but this is just what has been working for us. Next thing I want to share with you guys is this candle that I got from Anthropology. It's in the, the passion fruit mandarin and it smells so good. So I have this in my bedroom actually, because I don't know, at night, I just like lighting a candle, laying in my bed, watching TV, catching up on shows, editing vlogs, things like that. I just like to have a candle lit, and this is the one that I have been using in my bedroom. It smells so good. I love the pink little, like, mermaid-type looking jar that it comes in. And I'm actually going to save this jar once it runs out because I feel like I could use it for something else. But it's really nice. It smells good. I got it on sale during a sale that they were having. So I, if I can find this one, I'll put a link. This is the small size. I think it comes in a bigger one, but the bigger one was sold out at the time. So yes. All right, guys. And last but not least is my new MacBook Pro. This came as an unexpected surprise, but necessary purchase. Um, because I am working from home, it is essential that I have a, a good working computer. Um, my MacBook that I have still up there, it was starting to kind of, it's on its last leg. I've had that one since 2010. It still works. Um, I let Sefton use it now to do his classwork assignments and it still works fine. But for what I needed for work and for YouTube, I had to get a new computer so I love it I got it in this like steel gray color it's very nice and compact um, unlike my other one which is extremely heavy <laughs> um, that one is a 15 inch this one is a 13 so yeah I just love it so much so wanted to share that with you guys I will put a link to the exact one that I got So yeah, guys, that is it. That is everything that I wanted to share with you all today. I hope you all enjoyed this video. If you have any questions or comments, just list them below and I will catch you in the next one. Bye.